Hi everyone, it's Cherry Enchantress. I'm here with the flip through and I love this little deck, it's so cute. So my friend Kate Kaita from the Kaita Boutique <laughs> in um, Etsy has a really lovely little collection of cards. She, she similarly um, um, collects beautiful artwork from different artists and this one is the it's called the Dreamland Tarot and it's artwork by Hans Zatzka he's kind of a, um, a Victorian classicist romanticist artist and yeah you might like to check out some of his artwork um, and also that genre of art which is really lovely and mostly uh mostly um royalty free because it's um, pretty old and classic art it came all the way from latvia see latvia <laughs> and uh comes it doesn't have a box it doesn't have uh, it's not wrapped but it comes with this nice little cloth and I will show it to you, but before I start, I want to show you real quick, um, you've probably seen it before, but just so you can kind of get a, in context of the artist, I mean the uh, shop, I'm going to show you her Christmas tarot deck. This one is comes in a red bag, and it's those adorable postcards that you get. That, you know the vintage postcards she does a really good job of collecting artwork and translating them to the the symbols of the um, the tarot and I like them very much um, the card stock is a little bit like a card like a I don't know more like an index card than really a playing card texture it's it doesn't it seems like it would be pretty fragile but um, and it and the finish I think might not always represent the artwork as could as good as it could, but I think in a general sense it's it's still very charming. Um, yeah, for 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 what it is, I think it you know it doesn't have to be super superior quality <laughs> texture. So I am ready to take a look now at the Dreamland Tarot. I think it looks. Very nice. I like having a collection of my favorite artist's artwork. Alright, I'm gonna make sure this zooms in nicely. <clears throat> you see it? It's it's not as clear when it when I turn it into the shadow. Let's see. There we go. Okay. New Beginnings, Innocence, Wonder. These are great because if if you might, you know, of course there's artwork. And so, believe me, I know very well how hard it is to match up artwork to the symbols of astrology. She does a really good job, but some of them are going to be very just beautiful pictures and not really sure what the what the symbol what card you're talking about so it's great that she adds words with this I think but you can also use them as oracle cards if you like too with you know not following the the actual wording high priestess Oh, the emperor. There's not a lot of men in here. That's true. That's for sure. But that's okay. The other deck that she made that I wanted so bad, but um, it sold out, and then she just didn't reorder any. It was a was a pinup girl collection. But I think I'm gonna make my own somehow. <laughs> the lovers is so sweet. I mean, finding all these Hans Saska artwork is really was very ambitious. Chariot. Justice. 
the Hermit. Wheel of Fortune. Strength. I mean, some of these, I, th I would say, like, the contrast may be kind of high, but I think that's all right. Thank you. Hmm. It's a very gentle duck. Very gentle devil as well. <laughs> tower. Very gentle tower. <laughs> Star. Well, of course, with Hansatska, you're not going to find a lot of decay and destruction and dark stuff. It's going to mostly be happy images. Judgment. Mm -hmm. So cute. The world. This did take a long time to get here, and I almost had forgotten that I ordered it, and I was like, oh, there it is. <laughs> and now I, I was just like, oh, well, I wonder if I'll ever get my, my pin of gold one, but I don't think that's ever going to come. Three of Wands. Four of Wands, Five of Wands, Six. This is in one of my, like, uh, I'll show it to you. One of my original, from my original, I've been working on my Fairy Forecast deck, and so I have a lot of the original art, the original pictures over here. And it is, you know, it's tricky. It's like you have to frame it well and adjust the coloring sometimes. And so there's mine. <laughs> and it's fun when, you know, when you can get a big size. But yeah, Hansatska has, has good fairy images or some, some fairies, some lot of little angels and cherubs and things like that. Very romantic and little chubby faced women and babies. Eight of Wands. She picked good keywords though, at least she's got that right. And my um enchanted romance I made a like a little cheat sheet that has all the keywords. So I wouldn't have to write them down. Mm -hmm. That's good. King of Wands, I like that. So there's not a lot of men, but at least I think all the kings are a couple picture, which is kind of nice. There's a lot of couple pictures in here. Ace of Cups. You might recognize some of the couples from um, the Romance of Angels Oracle, because I think she's Doreen and David, what's his name, the artist, <laughs> uses a lot of a lot of classical images and just kind of photo real real reality changes them up, plays with them. Four of Cups. Five of Cups. Six of Cups. Seven of Cups. Daydreaming. I like that for Seven of Cups. That's good. Eight of Cups. 
Eight of Cups is the walking away, but away. That, that's good. Yeah, because riding out, walking away, that would take up too much of that space. The precious space that we have. These cards. Page of Cups. That's pretty. They're just all perfect and beautiful. Just my preference would be that the um, contrast wouldn't be so high, but I think it's otherwise really beautiful and perfect. Queen of Cups. Mm, that's so cute. The King of Cups. You do a little angel baby. Ace of Swords. Two of Swords. Ooh, Three of Swords. She's not very heartbroken looking. <laughs> but that's kind of what my face does when I'm in pain. I go numb. I just like, I have become comfortably numb. And I'm pretending I'm happy, but I'm not really. <laughs> Four of Swords. Five of Swords. Finally, a downturned face. <laughs> Six of Swords. A lot of pointing going on. <laughs> and the sword is like, um. Seven of Swords. Maybe her, what she's doing is giving him a Jedi mind trick. You will give me the apple. It does belong to me. Eight of Swords. Nine of Swords. That one's so pretty, huh? They all are. Look how it's... I mean, every, very, every single one is different from the other, so... Very good. Oh, I like, the, like our cheeks. Such chubby, cute people. <laughs> ten of Swords. Yeah, this would be a hard one to see as Ten of Swords. Picking his toes. <laughs> Page of Swords. I would say, if you got these, it would be more for the collection than anything else, but... You, you can definitely use them, and especially if you just wanted to use them as oracle cards. And see the back, it's easily trimmable. It would make it quite small. You could even um, trim them down, take the words away, and laminate them even. But yeah, I mean, you could take the, the tarot words away and, and turn them into little baby oracle cards. That would be a possibility. <laughs> King of Swords. I love how these women's women are draped so beautifully. Now we're getting into a happier ground here with the tentacles and abundance. Three pentacles. <laughs> Four pentacles. Five of pentacles. Yeah, at least that one is a little not as happy as the other one, so it's a good choice. Six of pentacles. It's good. I know that one. There's several pictures like this where there's women with the guy on top. Hmm. Wait, who did it first? I don't know. Maybe it was Zatska that did it first. Seven of Pentacles. Eight of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles. Ten of 
Pentacles, Page of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, such a cute face, <laughs> a little dimpled chin, and the King of Pentacles, and see another couple picture. See, like, man, if you could find these, you could definitely turn them into, like, another edition of Romance Angels Oracle, <laughs> you know, cards. And write your own, make your own. But there you go. And it's very simple backing, nothing too fancy and flashy, and very nice. It's just an adorable, beautiful collection of Hansatsuka art, and I hope you like that. Faith, trust, and pixie dust.